Good evening, everyone. I want to do a forecast for the Leafs this weekend, or Saturday and Sunday, just to try to get back and follow up something that I love doing, because uh, weather changes every single day, and weather does not get boring, and I got to get my passion off the ground. It's been pretty rough. I've been in pretty rough shape the last couple of weeks and I need to, you know, break out of it. So, without further ado, this first image right here is a cold front that is trying to cross the region today, but the front is moving in very, very slowly, so all the showers and thunderstorms along this line is going to fall apart due to the daytime heating is gone and nighttime is now progressing so all these showers and thunderstorms are going to be breaking apart by 8 9 o'clock tonight only western mass is going to get these showers and storms this, this cold front will be lingering around on uh, saturday given uh, a 50 to 70 percent chance of showers and thunderstorms for your saturday I can take a look at one of the models right now. See that line right there? That line right there is going to fall apart. Then by the time the afternoon comes, there's going to be a few showers and thunderstorms, mainly in central and to western mass, as you can see from this uh, little diagram right here. That front moves, that, uh, that cold front, seems to get out of here and by the time Sunday comes there's a low pressure system will be sweeping across the region so by Sunday night into Monday afternoon we're gonna have some heavy rain showers and thunderstorms this model doesn't go far enough Sunday there is gonna be showers from south to north in Massachusetts there's gonna be isolated showers and thunderstorms while most of the day is gonna be dry Saturday and Sunday, you just have to look for the uh, showers and thunderstorms in, in Western and Central Mass on Saturday. They're going to be very isolated on Sunday. Sunday is better than Saturday at this point. And by the time we get to uh, past midnight, actually it looks like mainly dry on Sunday. It's going to be past midnight on Monday. This model doesn't go fast enough. Pardon me. But it's going to be past midnight on Sunday. It's going to be in Monday before the rain and thunderstorms come in from the slow pressure system. I say most of the day looks like it's going to be uh, periods of isolated downpours and heavy rain. It looks like Monday looks to be the worst of the, the next three days. I was just going to do the weekend, but I figured I'd do sun, uh, Monday because Monday was uh, pretty much the same uh, pattern. I, w I was going to do the weekend, but I figured I had Monday pass at like a plus one. And this uh, low pressure system seems to move out of here on my t by at least Tuesday morning. And then the rest of the week looks good till like Thursday and Friday when another cold front comes in, it will give more chances of showers and thunderstorms. So uh, that's your three day forecast plus a little, uh, a little um, synoptic into the following week so uh i catch you in another update when i can do so this is me all it's just wx rg 96